So, in today's video, we will be talking about another effed up date. So, I'm not sure where I met this dude. Online, on a site, on one of the sites. I can't remember. Um, I don't think he lived that far from me because we was talking for not even that long. But he said, would I like to go out for something to eat? So I said, yeah, okay, fine, no problem. And so we went to Nando's at Elephant Castle. So I thought, okay, I don't mind. I'm not into no expensive things, so Nando's is fine for me. If you want to take me to some posh restaurant, that's fine too. Whatever. Either way, if I've got to pay for myself, I'm paying for myself. I always walk with my money. That's what my mum told me. Make sure you've got your own money. Anyway, so, I can't remember if I just said, but his name was Mark, with a C. And we met up at um, Nando's, gave him a hug, we waited to be seated, we sat down, we ate. He wasn't saying much, he kept like smiling and maybe he was nervous, I don't know. Anyway, I ordered my chicken fries and chips and salad and he got some, I think, mild peri-peri thing very very chicken and he kept while we was waiting he kept saying um how he likes nubian women like okay you like nubian women so i'm black yes but what he was trying to say is that i wasn't dark enough i'm like okay so what are we actually doing here why would you why was you talking to me what do you want Oh, I keep going on and on and on and on and on. Saying how he loves Africa, he loved this, he loved that. So I was like, oh, so which African country have you been to then? None. I'm like, oh, okay. <sighs> so that was that. Food come. We ate and oh, he ate like a dog. I was so embarrassed. But oh, I held my head down and nibbled, as you do. And every time we looked up, he heard the peri peri sauce here and all around his mouth and I'm thinking can't you feel that there's something there uh, am I supposed to tell him to wipe his mouth like I tell like a, a child wipe mouth love like, uh... <sighs> anyway he got tissue he wiped his the ends of his fingers and I'm thinking so what about your mouth in the end he did lick, uh, do that but it was still there I think because he was fair the um, orange sauce showed up more so we left and he said oh do you want to walk along the embankment i said mm, yeah okay we can walk along the embankment and then he was like uh would you like to come to my house so i said no thank you not this time around but there wasn't nothing was flowing so i'm going to your house mate anyway so he's walking along the embankment in embankment he wanted to hold my hand so i'm like okay we'll hold hands no one around here knows me so that's cool <laughs> and um and then we come to where there's steps that can go down into the sea but you'd have to walk quite a way down to actually like touch the water a bit anyway so he said oh shall we sit here well, okay and then it, we sat down and then he put his arm around me and then all i saw was uh, so, so he was coming forward and I was going backwards and I'm like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Bearing in mind, you still got all that around the side of his mouth and what's your tongue doing hanging out like that? Who told you that that's how you snog? Is that what you do with everybody else? Just like a dog coming to lick your face in my books. Oh, no, no, no. Nah. And he's like, oh, why are you pulling away? And then I felt on my tip, I thought, oh, my God. So I got his finger and bent it back can you just not touch me he's like oh what's the matter what's the matter what do you mean what's the matter what what are you doing <sighs> anyway i just got up and walked back up the steps and he's like oh can i see you again we'll have to meet up another time soon i'm thinking you ain't seeing me again mate and i hope you find your nubian woman it's like i'm not saying all men but <sighs> the ones that i see to attract don't know how to be men don't know how to to dress, to wash. So you just want to have sex with your cheese balls and cheesy willy on what? No, not happening. Oh, God. So, um, I think, yeah, he went home. 
I walked up a bit and got on the bus to go home. <clears throat> and then I think he was I think he was texting me saying that he's lonely. He's in his room all by himself. Yes, well, if you live in a room all by yourself, you will be in a room all by yourself, won't you? No, can't you come round and see me? Blah, blah, blah. We had such a great time. I said, I'm really sorry, but no, you're not my type. I'm not interested. Sorry. Ugh, so that was the end of that. No luck again. He was a handsome dude. I wouldn't describe him, did I? He was, um, he had dark hair, really dark brown hair. Cut, the cut was okay and everything. He's white, uh, pink lips with orange nandos <laughs> around the side of his cheeks. Um, okay build, he was taller than me. I'm not sure how tall he was, but he was taller than me. Maybe 5'11", something like that. But, uh, no thank you. I think he just, he thought, like quite a lot of men think, if they take you out on a date or, uh, you know, to go to dinner or cinema or meet up, that the next step is to go to bed well not me okay maybe some people do that but i don't do that i when i was younger i didn't i weren't footloose and fancy free like that i got married quite young when i got divorced young then i was in long relationships so all this random meet up sex things it's not happening i mean if you're talking online or on the phone or texting or whatever and that comes up in a conversation and you both agree that's what you want, fine. But we didn't agree to do none of this hanky-panky shit. Do you know what I like? Do I know what you like? No. Oh, anyway. So I thought, okay, scrap that one then. When I think that was the last conversation that we had. Um, maybe I blocked him, maybe I didn't. Like I said, it was ages ago, so I don't remember. Anyway, thank you for watching. These ones that I've told you so far are the shortest ones. I've got to write down and get all the other ones in the right order so I can tell you it properly without me going, mm, oh, mm, mm. So, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. And until the next video, I will see you then. Bye. Bye.